Uh, fertilizers can be uh, helpful and can contribute a lot to improve the human uh, health. There are, uh, unfortunately, uh, soils which are deficient in, in these micronutrients, like zinc, iodine, selenium, boron, and uh, other things that help uh, the food become more nutritious and that help you to become healthier. And uh, all we have to do is to make sure that when we are planting uh, the, the, f the seeds, we have to make sure that the, uh, uh, all the uh, nutrients and micronutrients are available to the plants. So what we are doing, in fact, by fertilization, is we are feeding the plant. Instead of the humans, we are feeding the plant. This is the nutrition for the plant. And this will be transferred to the humans who will eat them and uh, the deficiency will be, uh, will be eradicated. The Turkish soils were deficient in uh, zinc. Uh, we became aware of it. Uh, by the approach of some scientists from the Ministry of Agriculture. They said, would you be interested in adding micronutrient zinc to your fertilizers? We produced, I remember exactly, 2,300 tons. And uh, we said uh, to each farmer, we want you to allocate at least uh, 1,000 square meter of your land to us. We will show you that this fertilizer means uh, is a better fertilizer than the rest of them. So when we visited the fields, we saw, I, I was there on this visit too, we saw that uh, the, uh, the wheat uh, was already grown like uh, two or 20, 25 centimeters where it was uh, fertilized with zinc enhanced fertiliz fertilizers and the rest was just like a bleak land. Uh, and it, they said, this is normal, but what did you do with this one? We said, uh, well, this is zinc enhanced uh, fertilizer. Other micronutrients, unfortunately, need the support of the government, because the farmer will not demand it. That is a, a big reason. Selenium will not reflect any, any uh, result on the yields. Uh, if, for example, the wheat or any other uh, product that he has produced, which contains uh, selenium or iodine or others, can be uh, you know, priced at a higher level, and the government can pay that gap, so that the farmers have an uh, initiative or the encouragement to follow that. This is a kind of, uh, you know, uh, ways the government should pursue in order to uh, help combat this malnutrition.